hope you're all doing great today. And today I am doing an unboxing of the January Birch Box. It just looks like this. And it's really, really cute, but I recently resubscribed, so this is my first box in like a year. So I'm really, really excited. I've already taken off, you know, the mailing box, as you can tell. Um, so I'm just going to open this up and go through it all, and let's get started. So the first thing I see here is the card, as the box says. 2015 let's do this that is the theme for the month oh and if you're not familiar with subscription services like Birchbox this one is basically ten dollars a month and it curates samples based on a beauty profile that you fill out um, based on your needs your skin type all these different things what you like and you get four to six samples depending um, and there are also options to upgrade your box um, but yeah, so this is the front of the card with the theme on it, and here's a list of all the products I've got. Um, the first thing I see here is Harvey Prince Hello Exfoliating Shower Gel. I did not know they make shower gels now, um, but I have gotten this perfume before, and I think I liked it. I am going to be going on two trips in the next month and a half, so it'll be good to have a couple of shower gels on hand for those. So... We're happy with this. Um, it's only 15 mil, and I will try to put the prices of the samples in the description box so that you could see how it compares, like how much you're getting for your money for that $10 a month that they charge you for this. Um, but the full size of this is $22. But like I said, I'll try to do all the breakdowns in the description box so that we can know how much money I'm actually getting in this box. And the next item I see here is the Wish Body Butter in the Lavender Scent. It just looks like this, and I've got to say, I'm really excited about it. And I'm really excited about this one because back when I was subscribed to Birchbox for a few years, I got sent this shower gel, not the shower gel, the shave gel in one of my boxes. And I forget when the smell of that one, I think it was more of like a plain scent. But either way, it was a really good shave gel. I would have bought the full size if I could justify it. Um, but I tend to be a cheapo and stuff like that, so I didn't. But it was a really nice product. So I'm really excited to use this. I like body butters. Um, and it smells really, really good. Um, just putting some on my hand here. Yeah, it smells really nice. I personally like the lavender scent. It may not be for everybody. It's, it's it feel it doesn't feel like the thickest cream, but when you put it on, it feels very hydrating. And I think this is a good size sample. Um, as long as it's full, you could probably use this for a week or two. Um, and the next thing we have here is well, I can't read this. <laughs> it's all. Shimmery, can't read it. Got... This is the Key West Aloe Gentle Aloe Facial Cleanser. Oh, I'm sorry. The Wish also, by the way, is a full size is twenty four dollars, and then a full size of this Key West Aloe Gentle Facial Facial Cleanser. Um, a full size of this is sixteen fifty. So I don't know how many ounces that is, but that's pretty good for a non drugstore brand to charge for a concealer. A cleanser? A cleanser? Where am I getting this concealer thing from? I don't know guys, things are a little bit cray. Two videos a week for me. I can't speak properly, it's just, I don't know what we're gonna do with me guys. I don't really know. Um, but let's see what this says. Yeah, it doesn't seem to have anything special about it except for the fact that it's got aloe in it, so that might be nice. Um, so this will be interesting to use. I don't like to change up my skincare routine too much. But yeah, this is a whole ounce. And, I mean, I don't know about you guys, but this would probably last me around a month. Because um, all you need is a little bit, I'm assuming. And so the next product I have here is from Miraness, if I'm pronouncing that right. And it is the Mad Affinity Lip Rouge. And I think it's in Cosmic. Yeah, and I'm excited, and here's like the little foldy package thing it's in, and then you open it here, um, and it, tell, it shows you how to apply it. Very, very useful. <laughs> um, but it 
it just comes in a gloss thing, and I'm pretty, it says New York on the, the cap thing, um, and it is, oh, it's in color number three, New York, so Cosmic is not the color, um, and it's a red, it's like a pinky red color, it's got a cool applicator, so it'll be super easy to apply, just looks like that. Um, it's very pigmented. It seems a little sticky, um, like it's got little sticky things going on in it. I don't even know if I'm describing that right. Um, but it's got really good pigmentation. Um, I am excited about this even though it looks like it might be a little bit sticky because I have gotten a pencil lip color in a reddish gold color one time in a birch box, you know, back when I was subscribed the last time. And I really, really like that. That's actually a mainstay look color for me. It's almost always in my handbag. So I've got high hopes for this. And we'll see how that goes. If you're interested in hearing my opinion on any of these in a future video, let me know down in the comments. Also, be sure to like this video if you like Birchbox, if you like subscription boxes. If you want me to do more videos like this, just give it a thumbs up and let me know down in the comments. Um, but I have one more product that is in my box this month, and it is a When Travel Mate, and it is one of those face masks that you just sort of put on your face and sort of let it sit there. Oh, and I should have mentioned the Mirror Nest full size is $29. But back to this face mask, I'm excited about this because I love to give my face a little bit of a pampering, you know, on Sundays, and these are good to do for that. These are also good to travel with because they're easy to just throw in like your three ounce bag and, you, you know, use to like sort of rehydrate yourself and sort of regroup after a long haul flight, um, which I have to take one of the longer flights I've ever taken in the coming months. Um, so that will come in handy for that. And this retails for $28 in a set of four. Um, so, you know, divide that by four and you've got the price of this. And like I said, I will put all that information down in the description box so that we can do comparisons. Um, but yeah, that's everything I received in my January 2015 Birch Box. Um, overall, without, you know, totaling up the dollar amounts. I'm excited because I really like face masks, so I'm excited about this. Um, I always love Wish products. They're always really, really nice, and this one seems like it's going to deliver. Um, I'm excited for the lip color. I don't say no to lip colors. I've been on a lip color kick. I carry, like, four or five at a time in my handbag now, so I'm excited about that. Yeah, overall, I'm really happy with my first Birch Box after resubscribing. Um, I'm happy with the sample size, which was one of the reasons why I had stopped my subscription, you know, last year. Well, that's all I have for you today. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.